Ready. Okay, we're at the Vintage Garage and showing one of the more interesting and sometimes scary looking processes, which is straightening rods after boring. We have here a set of connecting rods that have been bored and radiused. And before they get final cleaned and set to uh, fit, we check them for straightness and twist. This is a rod machine. It'll check whether the rod is bent and whether the rod is twisted. Um, typically, we end up with rods that are straight, but because of the way our boring machine works, which uses some very strong clamps here on the big eye, we end up with a little tiny bit of twist, and it's usually pretty consistent. In this case, we can see we have a rod that is dead straight. It's right into the, right into the white. And we have a rod that is just like the others we've done this morning, which has a small amount of twist to it. So what we are going to do is just put a quick mark on the rod of which way it needs to go and an arrow showing the way it needs to go on the other end. That's mainly just as a, uh, just as a reference. We clamp it down into a rod holder. And we're gonna do the scary part, which is to take a really big wrench, throw it onto our rod, and just give it a little bump upwards. And we may have to do this multiple times until we get it straight. But we just have to take it slightly past its elastic limit. And you can see we're almost there. We've taken it uh, um, pretty close. It shows it right on the line and well, it would be fine right there. I'm just going to give it a one more tiny little tweak and see if we can't get it right into where we want to be. We're still in the center, and here we are. Let me get it right where we want it, and we're into the white. So that is straightening rods. We do all six of them, and that makes sure that they are square in the bores.